What's up guys, it's Eric with Monday Family Man. How you guys doing? Today we're going to be doing another distance test out here on this nice, beautiful soccer field. Boom. We're going to be testing the Tracker Pixel, which is Tracker's new Bluetooth tracker versus the Chipolo Classic. We have previously tested the Chipolo Plus, which did fairly well. But today we're going to be doing the little brother the Chipolo Classic. Now what's nice about both of these trackers is that they're both have replaceable batteries. If you guys haven't seen the unboxing of the Tracker Pixel, definitely click right up here and you guys can check that out first. Also, I've done a unboxing of the Chipolo Classic. If you want to see that video, click right up here also and check out both of those videos. But without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. be doing a bunch of different distance tests one's going to be here when it's hanging in the goal box one's going to be on the ground and then we're going to go inside and do a indoor distance test of both of these trackers of course you're going to get different results in your area depending on what type of environment you're in what kind of signals are around what kind of what's what obstacles are in the way since we have the netting here, we're going to hang the trackers from the netting as one of my viewers suggested. You can tell this is the classic because it has a little sound hole right there at the, in the O. And then we have the tracker pixel right over here. Let's measure the field. Alright, we are just at the penalty box, which is about 54 feet. We're going to keep on going. Almost there. Alright, so this is 100 feet. Go ahead and reel this thing back. Alright, let's do this again. Alright, we are approaching center field. Right now. The center field is 181 feet. So that makes the field 362 feet if my math is doing is correct. Just like last time, we're gonna have a separate camera here at the location of the Chipolo Classic. That way, when I do ring it, you're able to hear it and you can also see where I am on the field. If you guys wanna see the distance test of the original Chipolo Plus, go ahead and click right up here. You can see it did fairly well. All right, so here we are. We're gonna go ahead and make sure all other apps are shut down. And we're gonna start up the Chipolo app. And here it is, the black remote Chipotle Classic and we're gonna ring this and you can see it rings just fine. All right, let's start walking. All right, we're gonna make our first stop right here at the goal of the box or the penalty box. And we're gonna turn around, hit the ring to find. I can definitely hear it. Can you guys hear it? All right, we're gonna stop it. That was at 54 feet, let's keep going. All right, we are at 100 feet. See, there's the, the tape at 100 feet. And we're gonna hit ring the find. And I can definitely hear it. So let's keep on going. Now you can see we did start losing connection. We're probably at 120 feet or so. Turned around, it came back in. Let's go ahead and ring it. it says it's ringing, but I can definitely cannot hear it. I do have some wind out here though. Can you guys hear it? Let's turn back around, let's keep on going. Seems to be okay, it just might have just been a little glitch, which does happen with Bluetooth all the time. All right, we are approaching half field, which is 181 feet, and we're gonna ring the fine. And I can't tell if it's ringing or not, so hopefully you guys can hear it, and we'll find out in post if it's working or not. Let's go ahead and stop ringing. But as far as what's showing on the phone, it's saying that it is ringing. We're gonna keep on going. All right, we're about halfway through the second half, which is, if my math is right, it's about 240 feet, roughly. Let's go ahead and ring the fine. And once again, I cannot hear it, but it shows that it's ringing. Can you guys hear it? Can't tell. We're gonna keep on going. And we are approaching the penalty box of the other side of the field. We're gonna go ahead and hit ring the fine. And it's showing that it's ringing, but now it lost connection. And this is probably about 320 feet. Now I've got the connection back. And can you guys hear it? 
seems to be coming in and out. It's not holding it very well. We're gonna hit it again and it seemed to lose it. Yeah, see it's 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 definitely intermittent. Let's go ahead and go back and try the tracker pixel. Alright, here's the tracker pixel. We're gonna go ahead and make sure all apps are shut down once again. And we're gonna turn on the tracker app. Alright, got the tracker app up and running, and you can see we are right next to this thing. I'm still losing one bar, which is not good at all. We had this issue with the Tracker Bravo also. If you guys want to see the distance test of the original Tracker Bravo, which had a little trouble in their distance, you guys can click right up here and watch that video. So don't, I have a feeling this is not going to go very far. But let's go ahead and do it. Let's walk. All right, we're walking. Losing another bar, another bar. We're down to two bars. And we are right at the penalty box. Let's go ahead and turn around and ring it. I can definitely hear that very nicely. It's definitely a good sound. Much louder than the Tracker Bravo. And we are approaching just about 100 feet. Glad that some of the bars came back a little bit. We are 100 feet now. And look like it lost signal for a second. I'm gonna give it a chance to get back. I had the signal and then I lost it. So let's take a few steps up. Still nothing. All right, we got it back. Let's go ahead and ring it. And I can definitely hear it. Can you guys hear it? Let's take two more steps back. Try it again. And I can hear it. Two more steps back. We are back at 100 feet. As you can see over there, that's the 100 mark. And we're down to one bar. Let's go ahead and ring it. And it took a second, but I can definitely hear it. It definitely rang. Let's take two more steps back. And we are losing that signal once again. Now, if I do remember correctly, I do think they said it's up to 100 feet on the tracker pixel. And I think it's Chipotle that says up to 200 feet. So I think they're correct about their advertising because I'm just getting about 100 feet of their max distance. So give or take a few feet. Let's go ahead and go back and put these things on the ground and test them. Chipolo Classics right there and the Tracker Pixels right there. Let's go ahead and do the Chipolo Classic first. We'll make sure all the apps are closed down. And we're gonna go into Chipolo app and we're going ahead and ring it. You can hear it just fine. All right, let's start walking. All right, we are approaching the penalty box and we're gonna go ahead and ring it and we can hear it just fine. All right, let's stop the ringing and let's keep on walking. Oh, we're starting to lose the connection. We're probably about 75 feet roughly and we're gonna turn around and it looks like we lost the connection altogether. Let's walk back up a little bit. Yep, we're losing it. We're back at the penalty box and we're still not getting the signal back. Let me go ahead and put this down and go get my tape measure and see how close we actually are. Alright, I'm back. I got the tape measure out and the line to the goalie box or the penalty box is 54 feet and I still don't have a signal. So let's go ahead and walk up and see when we regain it. Alright, I took about three steps forward and I started to get regain it. So let's go ahead and ring it and I can definitely hear it. Can you guys hear it? So we are at 48 feet to be exact. I'm gonna take one step back. We are at 50 feet. We're gonna ring it. And the wind picked up, so I can't hear it. Can you guys hear it? I'm gonna step back to the penalty box at 54 feet. And once again, I lost it. So the range is between that 50 and 54 feet, roughly, for the Tripolo Classic. Let's go ahead and go back and try the Tracker Pixel. All right, there's the Tracker Pixel. We are ready to rock and roll. We're gonna shut down the app, go back into the Tracker app, and I do, I thought I had a full signal, full bar. Oh, keeps going in and out. We can definitely hear it. That is definitely a nice sound. Nice and loud. All right, let's go ahead and go walking. And we just lost two more bars, two more bars. We're down to two, and we are at 10 feet. Let's keep going. All right, we are at 19 feet. 
We're gonna turn around and ring it, and it definitely has a signal. It's turning off, let's go back around. All right, we're starting to lose it. We're at 23 feet. I'm gonna turn around, and I have no signal whatsoever. Let's move up a couple feet. We're at 28 feet, 26 feet. Now at 23 feet. Sorry to get the signal back. Let's go ahead and ring it. And I can definitely hear it nice and loud. Turn this off. Let's take two steps back. And we lost the signal at 27 feet. The thing's still ringing from the last time. We went to go 25 feet and we got the signal back. And we lost it again before I was able to push the button. So I would say about 22 to 25 feet on the ground, but it's definitely not near where the Chipola Classic was around the 50 feet back there. So as you guys saw, the Chipola Classic did much better than the Tracker Pixel. I am very happy the Tracker Pixel did advertise around about 100 feet, and it's getting about 100 feet in their max distance. But the overall distance is nowhere near the Chipola Classic, which is near probably about 300, 325 feet. So let's go ahead and go indoors and do the distance test indoors. A little diagram of my house and if you guys would add up all these numbers right here and you can see that the width of my house is 62 feet from this end to this end. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to place one of the devices over in the dining room and then I'm going to walk over into the family room. And just for um, reference, there is a wall between the dining room and the kitchen right here. Otherwise, between the kitchen and the family room is open, so the only thing between the tracker and the iPhone is going to be this one wall. Also understand that I have other wireless devices in the house. I have a Wi-Fi network with multiple devices connected. Alright guys, let's go ahead and do this and see how they do. So here's the one wall that I'm talking about and you can see here is the dining room and I'm going to put it in that corner and then I'm going to be walking through the kitchen to the other side of the house. Alright, I got the trackers up here just like last time on the far side of the house and we're going to go ahead and make sure all the apps are shut down. We're going to start the Chipolo app and you can see it's connecting and it's ready to ring and just like that it is ringing all right let's turn this off and we are going for a walk all right we are about three quarters of the house at 40 43 feet we're gonna ring it and i can definitely hear it let's keep on walking all right then we are now at the far side of the house we're gonna ring it and once again it rings let's go back here by the sunroom by the back door where I tend to lose some trackers back here so we're back here at the back door let's go ahead and ring it and I can definitely hear it nicely let's go ahead and go back and try the tracker pixel all right we are back we're gonna go ahead and shut down the Chipolo app and we are going to start up the tracker app and for my privacy, I'm not going to show you the top part of this phone. But we're going to start walking away, and I'm already losing two bars. We'll keep on walking. All right, we're about three quarters away at 43 feet. Let's go ahead and ring it, and I can definitely hear it nicely. Let's keep on walking. All right, we are just about at the far side of the house. We only have one bar left. It came back to be three bars. We're going to have it ring it, and we can hear it nicely. All right, let's go ahead and go back here by the back door into the sunroom. And as I'm getting closer to the back door, I'm starting to lose it, and I lost it. Start walking back just a little bit, see if I regain it. I'll walk up a little bit more, still nothing. I'm going to go back into the living room. All right, now I am back into the living room. That's my dog, Chloe. And we did got a signal back. We're gonna ring it, and it rings. I'm gonna take two steps back. We're gonna try to ring it from here. And I get nothing. All right, guys, let's wrap up this video. If you guys have any questions or comments, leave them down below. I will answer those when I get a chance. If you guys haven't already seen the unboxing and review video of the Tracker Pixel, click right up here. 
If you guys haven't seen the unboxing and review video of the Polo Classic, click down here. I hope I've earned your subscription. If I have, click this blue button and subscribe to my channel. If you guys want to become a super subscriber, check out my Patreon page right up here, this blue square, and become a Patreon. I appreciate all the love and support. I will see you guys on the next video. Have a great day.